Hi, this is Randy Rice of RiceConsulting.com. In this short video, I want to give you a basic overview of the ISTQB certification program for software testers. I'll also have some follow-up videos available soon on frequently asked questions about the certification, so feel free to email me your question from my website at RiceConsulting.com. I've been involved in software test certification programs since 1996 when Bill Perry and I designed and started the CSTE program at QAI. Now I'm supporting the ISTQB program because of its large international adoption and rapid adoption here in the U.S. At the recording of this video, there are around 150,000 uh, certified foundation-level testers worldwide and approaching 10,000 foundation-level testers in the U.S. There are also over 40 national boards that comprise the ISTQB. Some of the countries, like the United States, have their own exam boards. Uh, in the USA, the exams, the accreditation of training providers and, the, the, and their courses, as well as the management and promotion of the ISTQB certification, is by the American Software Testing Qualifications Board, or the ASTQB. There are uh, three levels of ISTQB certification, uh, the foundation, advanced, and expert levels. Uh, everyone goes to the foundation level, and from that point you can take any of the advanced certifications, and once you have an advanced certification, uh, you can take the expert level certifications. Uh, each level is based on a common syllabus that's written by a large number of international software testing practitioners and experts. Now, you can download these syllabi for free at uh, astqb.org or riceconsulting.com. If we take a look real quickly here, uh, I'll show you where to find those. Uh, on the ASTQB's website, uh, just go under Educational Resources and go to Syllabi, and uh, you will see this page for the Foundation Level, uh, the Advanced Level, and the Expert Level Syllabus, as well as the ISTQB Glossary. On my website at riceconsulting.com, uh, you can go to the Training section and the uh, ISTQB Foundation page, and from that point uh, you can find that we have the uh, course for foundation level uh, training, but also the syllabus and the glossary uh, are listed there. Now I do recommend uh, that you download those items and review those at least. Uh, Training is not required to take an ISTQB exam, but it is encouraged because of some of the unique ways that the ISTQB will define certain terms and processes. And if you go into the exam cold without knowing those, then uh, you may very well miss those questions. Now, speaking of the exams, the foundation level exam is 40 questions, all multiple choice, uh, and you have an hour to take that test. Uh, you have to achieve a 65% or greater passing score. And uh, you can take this at uh, a public course that may be given across the country by a training provider. Uh, or you can have someone like myself as a training provider come into your company and uh, provide a course. Uh, or you can have these taken online uh, at a Criterion Testing Center. So if you're just an individual, you want to take a test, um, you can find a whole list of those centers on the ASTQB website. The cost is $250 for the exam, and there's no prerequisites. Uh, you can take the exam uh, any time that you like. Uh, the advanced level uh, has 100 questions, all multiple choice. Uh, you can have up to three hours to take that test, and like the foundation level, you have to achieve a score of 65% or greater. And uh, like the foundation, you can take these at public courses, private in-house training, or at a criterion uh, testing center worldwide. The cost for this exam is $200. Uh, you must hold the CTFL, uh, certification and have three or more years of verifiable experience in software testing or related field and there's also a $100 qualification fee that's a one-time fee that you pay uh, to take any of the exams. Now the good news here is that you don't have to be re-accredited for the foundation and advanced levels so in other words once you're certified you hold that certification for life. Uh, no fees, no forms to file or anything like that. Now, if you're interested and want to know more information, you can always go to the ASTQB.org website. You can come to my website. Once again, you can email me your questions. Uh, you'll find at my website, riceconsulting.com, training courses in both foundation and advanced courses. So thanks for watching this video.